This is the Grumman EF-111A Raven, the Prowler's U.S. Air Force counterpart. The Raven also carries a version of the ALQ-99 tactical jammer system, but there the likeness stops because the Raven was produced by completely rebuilding aircraft originally delivered as General Dynamics F-111A bombers. The Raven is a sleek supersonic aircraft with afterburning engines and pivoted swing wings. Like the Prowler, the Raven groups its passive receiver antenna in a large cap on the top of the fin. But unlike the Navy's aircraft, the Raven has the ALQ-99E jamming system. Instead of being fitted in external pods, the active jamming equipment is installed internally. The emitting antenna are mainly in a ventral radome, called a canoe radome because of its shape. The jamming system is highly automated. Instead of needing the Prowler's three electronic warfare officers, the Air Force aircraft needs only one. No other aircraft has quite the same computerized ability to listen and search for hostile emissions, compare them with a comprehensive threat library, and take appropriate action. If a signal is in the threat library, it will be jammed in a minute fraction of a second. If not, it will be analyzed and recorded, then jammed if considered hostile. At all times, the system continues to search for fresh emissions. The Raven and the Prowler were both tested in combat during the Gulf War, and by all accounts, they were vital parts of the Coalition's complete domination of the skies. It's difficult to estimate how many airmen's lives these aircraft saved, but no one would want to fly into a battle without them.